Hi, this is Ms. Schnettler. I just wanted to make a quick video on how to do a screenshot. A screenshot is a picture of your computer screen, um, and it can be helpful for a number of different reasons. If you are having tech problems on your computer, being able to have a screenshot and send it to the person helping you can really help them to better understand your issue because they can see exactly what you're seeing. Or if you need to get a picture of something on your computer for an assignment but you can't copy and paste it because it's PDF like this document. Um, so it can be helpful for a lot of different reasons. So I come down here to the Windows icon and I use my snipping tool all the time so it's already up here in my pinned um, applications. Uh, sometimes with students I find if you scroll down in this section, which my computer doesn't have that as an option, will work and you'll find it there. Um, also, depends on the kind of computer you have, whether you will have Snipping Tool or Snip and Sketch. They work mostly the same, but what I'm going to do right now is show you what happens if you don't see that. So I'm going to click out of that Windows. I'm going to open Windows again. I'm not clicking anywhere. I'm just going to start typing. I'm just going to type snip because I don't know if my computer has snipping tool or snip and sketch. So if I only type snip, I'll find either one. In this case, it brings up snipping tool and I'm able to open it that way. I click new and again, snip and sketch will look a little bit different, but basically it's the same process. You click new and then you just drag a rectangle over what you want a picture of. That will bring you to this window in the snipping tool. Snip and sketch is a little bit different. I will explain that second. So for snipping tool, all you have to do is put your cursor over the picture. Sometimes it's hard to see it, but just make sure your mouse is over it. Right click, copy, right click, paste. It's that simple. You can also save it if you would like to. And you would do that by save as. I believe you can also come up here to file and do save as. With snip and sketch, uh, you won't have that option to right click. You only have the option up here. You'll have the icons look a little different, but you'll have two pieces of paper. That's copy. You can just click it. And then you can paste. Um, and then you also have save. All right. I hope this was helpful. Thank you.